On a theme today, twins. We're here with Linda and Terry, who are psychic twins. Part of this whole world is the skepticism, the healthy skepticism that has to come with this. Sure. I wish it were healthy. It's very often cynicism, not skepticism at all. Well, I'll tell you why I think the skepticism has a relevant place is that if you say this show's going to run for 10 years, I can say not if I quit tomorrow. But we don't say it's written in stone ever. You can, we teach you how to change your destiny yes. and psychic intelligence. Yeah, the future is fluid. It's never written in stone. We say it's written in pencil. So I can do a little erasing. There you can. Yeah. yeah. You can, you're much more powerful than you think you are. Okay. And you can change your destiny. I like this. Mm. I have many times. I know you have. <laughs> Can you turn this off, or is it just a constant flow of information? Well, for the mm. average psychic, it's like it has to hit you like a bolt from the blue. With us, we're like a radio. We turn it on, turn it off whenever we want. But we're hypervigilant. We're always, always uh, vulnerable to impressions, and so it's very hard to sleep. We have psychic dreams. It's almost as if we can't turn it off sometimes. And you have very vivid dreams. Yes, you do. In fact, you travel. You do astral travel in your yes. dreams. You go yes. places. Yeah? Yes, yes. you do. You. Yeah. Okay. I, I like that. Go with yeah. me, Jeff. Yeah, I am with safe. you. I am, I am with you. Yeah. Um, it's the interviewer in me now. If I were getting a reading, here's yeah. another question I have. Mm -hmm. I like that you guys are open to this back and forth. Yeah. Here's another question. Here in California on Ventura Boulevard, there mm -hmm. are psychic stores, shops. Mm -hmm. They're gypsies. Psychic. Gypsies. They're not yeah. psychics. Yeah. They so haven't what's proven, the difference? They haven't proven They're it. They're fakes. Most, most psychics are fakes, I, we hate to tell you. Find somebody who has the hundreds of world predictions that we have yeah. on tape, proof. We've got an indisputable, and I'll tell you a real psychic. indisputable That's a real track psychic. record. 300 predictions of world events that all happened exactly as we said and when we said. Now, I'm just curious from an audience point of view, how many of you guys buy into this, believe it, and believe they've absolutely... <laughs> that is... Definitely more than 50%. That's the majority. Of yeah. the majority. That yeah. was a big reaction. I want to talk to somebody in the audience. Pop up here. So, people are on one side of the fence or the other with psychics. Which side are you on? I agree. I know you do. I know. I agree, <laughs> meaning... God bless you. I think it's realistic. Yes. I think it's real. And I think you're onto something. We love you. I love you. And Thank you know you. what? I love you too. You're very, very psychic yourself. And you That's come how from, I know. Yes. That's right. And you come from a psychic family. I do. Right? Yes. What is happening? Yeah. <laughs> I'm tuning into them and they're tuning into me. Uh, so. She's reading us. Through yeah. okay. her earrings, yeah. Jeff. She's using her earrings. What's your name? Lola. Lola, oh. thank you. Have you're a seat. Welcome. You're okay. beautiful, Lola. All right. Somebody that does it. Yes. Hold on. Pop up. <laughs> Oh, pop up. Yes, what's your I name? I want to know my future, Catherine. Hi. Well, that, now that's it. Catherine? Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's something that must happen all the time is, oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. So well, she winked me. at me when she sat down, oh. so she's oh. thinking something behind oh. those eyes. <laughs> we had a moment. We did have a moment. What do you do? Because it's a fair question if you call mm -hmm. yourself a psychic to, for somebody to say, well, then tell me something. Yes, it happens constantly. It happens all day long, and usually mm. we'll, we'll say, well, what's your question about? Past, present, or future? Right, what's your past question lives, about? Future? Love. Finances. Financial. Sorry. Financial question <laughs> Financial. about the future? Okay. Okay, since we do automatic writing. My feeling just... is that you worry a lot, and you're kind of mm. blocking the flow. I want you to affirm that you are in the divine flow, and because you're worrying, you're really, you're mm. really blocking off the good stuff, and oh I feel goodness. like you're going to be okay, so yeah. you don't have to worry so much. Yeah, it's just an old bad habit is all, and, but it's like a hole in a leaky rowboat. All your fortune's going out, the hole in the rowboat, because you're only focusing on what you're afraid of losing. Now, does that, does that connect to you at all? Well, so if I let go of that flow, will it, what's going to well, happen then? that's why we wrote our books, to help you to learn how to develop your psychic ability. <laughs> Thank right. you for that segue. <laughs> Thank <Yay>. you. <laughs> anybody in here, anybody in here who doesn't, just doesn't believe psychics? You're not sure about this, huh? I'm not sure. I'm on the fence. Cause what, what's your name? Amanda. Okay, and you're not sure about this? Yeah, because some, um, I've had psychic readings in the past, and sometimes they were spot on, but then it depends on the psychic I find. It depends on the psychic. Yeah, and depend. I'm a very curious person, so I always yeah. like wonder about career especially. And stuff. Well, so like, in a way, yeah. you're asking for a reading <laughs> yourself right now. Is, is that what that was? A little bit, maybe. <laughs> you, 
You got anything for her? She's standing up. The question is for career. Is that yes, the question? I never know like what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> okay. Well, I feel like you're young yet, and you're mm -hmm. going to have a couple of different mm -hmm. careers. It's mm -hmm. you're creative. Yeah. I feel like you're talented with a lot of different areas: writing, yeah. design. Yes. Very okay. creative. Does that ring true? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yes. Well, yeah, yeah. As in, yeah, you think you're a writer, or do you write and design? I, I have written in the past, but not like seriously. Just like kind of yeah. for fun. Now, does here's the here's the trick. Or, or, here's the question. Does Linda and Terry suggesting you should write and be creative, will that make you go home and say, you know what, I think I am going to start writing? Absolutely. I mean, I'll give it a shot. Okay, so it. if Yay. that's the case. <laughs> I like your opening. Yeah. Okay, have a seat. So, so, if that's the case, and all it took was for you to get a suggestion from somebody who says they know, really the lesson is, follow your bliss because mm -hmm. you could have gone home and started writing anyway, right. right? Is one of the things, what this question brings up for me is one of the mm -hmm. things I wonder about is are people who call for readings looking for assurance? They're looking for insurance, insurance. and insurance policy. <laughs> <laughs> they want to win the lottery. They want to win, win the lottery. They want to make sure they'll meet a tall, handsome guy that's rich and married. And get a spot on the Jeff Probst show. <laughs> there you go. That's what they want. <laughs> Yeah. All right. Linda and Terry wrote a book called Psychic Intelligence. It is in bookstores now. Thanks, you guys. Great Thank job. You.